themselves and uh, several we have been seeing how our people is slumping and die because of a health and we decide to take it upon ourselves the executive this is the first time this thing has been done in this market since that nine years ago this market was established so, you can see things for yourself. We started this program since Monday. Tuesday. Wednesday. My name is Asa Ogeno. I'm a St. Chigozi. My boss is the Secretary General of the Union. I work with the market on the Chanambra State. Uh, what we are doing today is a medical outreach. Uh, inside the Bridget Market on the Bobo. It is a uh, wonderful exercise. Uh, everybody can attest to that. Uh, this is uh, an exercise that started uh, since Monday and they are about to end today. Though there are, some, there are some challenges we are facing anyway. Most people are out there shouting that the executives that we should try and make it possible for them at least to postpone the exercise from now till maybe another two weeks. So, but because of some things we have at hand, I don't, I don't see the possibility, but they say exactly we have their meeting by tomorrow in respect of that, to know if we can extend the date so that more people will come and they do what others have been doing and to enjoy or participate on what others have been enjoying before now. And since Monday till now, I went to my record. We've recorded close to 600 persons or patients. And people were very, very happy. And to surprise you, and from my record, not only people from Obogu, people from other nearby markets have been coming. And we know we are, we are the same. We can't scare them, we can't share them away. We allow every people to participate. So I think it's a welcome development. Everybody is very, very happy. If you go out there, they, they speak a, a lot of volume into this executive. And this exercise was read by the a chairman of the CTC members in the person of uh, Chukulota Ndubisi, evangelist, and with the co-executive, the support of the executives. Uh, we are very, very happy. The market, the entire general market, are very, very happy. But as I have said earlier, maybe by the end of today, we can know if we can postpone the exercise so that everybody will partake. Yes, our secretary of our book market, Richard. We are holding a free medical outreach organized by the members of the executive of the market. Because of uh, people who are badly affected by poverty, they cannot even eat. Doctors are in the hospital. That was Morrison decided to do this uh, exercise. We started it on Monday to end today. We have recorded over 500 and something patients. We invited doctors, the doctors there are four in number. The medical scientists, there are five in number. Then the pharmacists, there are three or four. So, and we are succeeding. People were very, very happy. They have been praying for us. They have been saying so many things in favor of the executive of the market because it cannot been done since over 39 years. 
So we were happy. Yes, I'm an honorary former a medical lab scientist. So we are we are here at the work to conduct medical outreach for the people. I want to thank uh, Mr. Governor, the Solution Governor, and the entire team of uh, of all the executives for organizing this outreach for for the market sale. so that at the end of the day they are able to benefit. They are not just all about eating and drinking, but at least they are able to have their health or know that health is also wealth. Dr. Asoba David, I was trained in the University of Nigeria as well. Bachelor of Medicine and Bachelor of Surgery. Currently I'm working at the General Hospital Marine. This is a medical outpost organized by the uh, uh, people. They invited us for this outreach. This outreach is all about head talk, counseling, public enlightenment program, free medication, free consultation. As you can see, we take our time to explain to our patients most of the uh, common diseases in our environment. We do not only prescribe the medication for them, but also lecture them, counsel them on the effects and the need to seek healthcare providers whenever they have problems. Most of the challenges are noticed among our people because this outreach mainly covers adults. It's adults, pediatrics are not included. So we found out that we have some of the common pathologies among that um, affects the people in the environment, which are hypertension, diabetic diabetes. From this outreach, it also encompasses investigation. Everything about this outreach are free. There are a lot of investigation like uh, uh, screening tests for prosthetic specific antigen, screening tests for hepatitis B, hepatitis C, malaria parasite, random blood sugar, why that for uh, uh, salmonellosis infection, then we also have other investigations, including drugs, and not drugs, quality and good drugs, which are all sponsored by the organizers of this outreach. It is free. Patients are being treated and investigated, and it has been running from Tuesday. Today is the last day, the four days free medical outreach. So I'm very, very happy that I'm here with the interaction that we have with our patients, and we're able to make some diagnosis and declare some common pathologies that affect the people in the environment. Thank you so much. My name is Dr. Mark Kudeta I'm a consultant family physician under the grace of the acting hospital administrator in Anambra State. Yes, the Commissioner of Health sent me here, the Commissioner of Health Doctor OBDK from sent me here to help the above people now to do a medical outreach, an elaborate medical outreach. Presently today, now today is the fourth day, the final day. We have seen up to we have seen over 500 people. And the, the Chairman of the award, uh, uh, here, Honorable and his executive is doing this. They said they want to keep him because Solude is doing what the uh, solution governor is doing to be held so that people will know that we are appreciating what the governor is doing. So, by doing this now, they, want, they are screening themselves, treating themselves, so they can also join in the free and better care and free delivery care and free uh, sexual care being pioneered by the solution governor, uh, Professor Shikuma Solude. So that is why we are here. Today is the final day. So the by and large, I know that before we round up that we must have seen up to close to 600 people. We are, we are just only 500 now, but I know before we close, we must have seen up to 600 people these four days now that we are doing the very good outreach.
subsistence, subsistence, the equipment of people in the hospital. That's why he introduced this free medical treatment to the above. The shining light that we bear We're the only ones to make her brighter The only ones to make her better The only ones to make an Ambra shine With our sweat and blood